Hey Panda Boy, how you doing? Hey Panda Boy, how you doing? Ever since I streamed on YouTube, so I gotta reset up everything. I think we're good though. Sloth, Daniel, Steel, Abraxas, how y'all doing? Hopefully we can stream this without YouTube having a fit and copywriting me, so it's crossed. <clears throat> hey Zeno, how you doing man? New place is uh pretty nice. It's the same apartment since so everything's just everything's just flipped. But uh pretty good, pretty good. I got a lot of shit in the old place, but um eh. <laughs> little by little, I need to get something done today as soon as we get the internet back up, so Hey, here we are. <clears throat> that should prime. Yeah, I was gonna do Twitch, but I wasn't too sure about it. So, I just kinda figured, fuck it, let's do YouTube. Uh, Alright, it's kinda getting people get a chance to get in. Notification. The, the, the cancer that is my stream spread. <laughs> and, uh... Now we have version 1.0.1.0. Blah, blah, blah. Um, hopefully this is like functional versus the demo. Let's put it that way. Look a bit tired. I am. I am a bit tired. I have a. Uh, yeah, my body is dead. <laughs> You lift 700 pounds of furniture or a line by yourself. Yeah, Cuddy Stabby, that's exactly what I've been trying to tell people. If this game is shit, I'm gonna say it's shit, but I'm not gonna say it's shit because EA, you know. If it's a bad game, it's a bad game, but if it's a good game, it's a good game. kilograms. I didn't know that. <laughs> Alright, well we already have doubled that of what we already have doubled that of what I would normally see on Twitch, so uh get started. Also <laughs> wiring is kind of a of a mess to say the least right now, but a lot of this is probably still gonna get switched around and changed a bit, so don't get used to this Dutch camera angle I have right now. But uh, alright, let's see what happens. But now I'm trying out Origins premier access subscription thing. Um, it really helped me out right now because I can't put $70 on this game right out the bat, but to be honest, this whole Origin thing is a Origin premiere thing really ain't that really bad a deal. I mean, you literally get 
EA's entire library for 15 a month, so, you know, it's not really something I can say it was bad. Also, I'll adjust the volume and everything after you do a couple things. Might be too quiet for you all right now. We live in a dangerous world. The gods who built it vanished, leaving behind their instruments that aimlessly reshaped the land. These ancient relics harness an unknowable force we call the Anthem of Creation. But the Anthem refuses to be controlled. To survive, our ancestors invented the Javelins and built cities with great walls. Today, it falls to a dedicated group of heroes to face the chaos, protect our homes, and fight for our very survival. We are freelancers. We leap head on into danger, rescuing the lost, keeping the monsters at bay, and silencing the Anthem's terrible cataclysms. But not all cataclysms are created equal. And even freelancers are wary of the untamed power of the Anthem. This is it. Close as we get with the Striders. Agreed. Looks like we fly from here. Alec, you hear that? Yep. All teams get ciphers to their amplifiers. Let's go! Freelancer! We're a long way from the cenotaph, and the storm is worse than we thought. Okay, this is as close as we're gonna get to the center of the strider getting ripped Put effort shreds. into the facial animations Let's again. Go, freelancers, shoot up! How crazy will this get? No idea. Never tried to shut down a cataclysm this big. Oh, steady, Faye. None of us come out of this alive without our cipher. Stay safe out there. Yeah. Remember, we're a team. I'm right there with you. Oh. Oh. Okay, Freelancer. You might be new, but you won't be here if you didn't show promise. Hey, Alec, what's up? Waiting for it to die down out there? Let's go! Uh, I thought you could use a head start. See you at the Cenotaph. We're heading out. Okay, everyone. Let's stop this cataclysm from growing. From killing everything. I don't know, Halleck. Haven't seen oh. anything like this before. Look, everyone. I won't be here if I thought this storm could beat me, right? Heart of Rage is no different than the hundreds of other Shaper ruins we've dealt with. It's just bigger. This is what we do. So we're gonna go in there and we're gonna take on whatever unholy beast that spits at us and we're going to tame that thing together. Let's Hell do yeah. it. Yeah. You definitely Ready, cleaned up the animation up? versus Ooh, the demo. Ready. Strong along, stronger together. Oh, okay. Bay? Bay, can you hear me? 
Now then, clear. That was a bad fall. How's your head? You remember the mission? I think so. Where am I? You're in a cataclysm, terrible storm, called the Heart of Rage. You need to get to the center and shut it down by silencing the cenotaph. Got it. Your suit is still Second. critical. Grab a repair pack when you can. We're going further. How's the volume and everything? I can't adjust it now before we get too deep into it. The pause. for the game already, so that's nice. I got you, Freelancer. We aren't gonna make it to the center now. Gonna try. I took care of all three Freelancers. What next? Push on and join your team. Along. Which way? Now, I've got a Titan on the bridge above. Leave it. We've got one up here, too. They're all over the place. I'll maybe go around. Which way, Kay? Hey. Holy shit. <laughs> Never mind. Titan here just blasted the wall out. Gave me a shortcut. We really need your help. Gotcha. On my way. Okay, I thought that was gonna sh I thought that was gonna be like a turret mission that was gonna start shooting down at us. How close am I pay? Trey, I dare. Get a little to his left. The anthem. It wants to consume me. To show me. Pay, snap out of it. What do you got for us? Oh, sorry, uh, the whole team from Strider 3 is gone. Miller, pull back. See if we can flank it. Strider 4 team is in retreat. If they make it, mission seems to. How far back? Hurry up. Where were you? Try it. I swear. It's all wrong. It's all done. Come back. Retreat. I... I can hear the anthem of creation. Hey, are we supposed to fall back? We're fine. We push on. Right team? I'm in. I'm in. Rookie, there you are. Get in here. Face call in a retreat. We got this. Almost there. Team, you need to retreat. Miller! Miller 
is okay. fucking dead. <laughs> he's gone. I'm oh. sorry. Oh, he's actually dead. This thing is going down. Come on. <laughs> that guy's super dead. Get back to the strider. This mission is over. I can do it. Look at this fate. We have to silence the cenotaph. Please, I'm barely holding it together. Retreat is an option. We got this bastard. We have to get out of here. No. We push on. We're the only ones left. Think about Miller and Adair. All the others. You being a coward. I'm no coward. No? You want to push forward until I get killed. Uh, uh, until we both get killed. Where? Where did that come from? Go. Babe, we're coming back. No. It beat us, Halleck. We need to regroup. It can't beat us. Rookie, don't you dare pull me out of here. We're not really pulling it. You kind of just got up and ran with us, honey. Feel free to turn around if you want. During the failed attempt to silence the heart of rage, we lost more than freelancers, more than friends and comrades. We lost the faith of the people we protect. So the freelancers scattered, searching for ways to redeem themselves. The few who remained carried on, finding new allies where they could. Doing their best to help a people who no longer called the freelancers heroes. Tell if those things are what you would call cute or not. I'm at the coordinates, Owen. Impressive entrance, as usual. Nice to be appreciated. Ah, don't sell yourself short, mate. A cipher couldn't ask for any better partner. You could ask, but not many of us left. The relay's a short flight away. Easy contract so far. Easy keeps you alive. I wouldn't call this living. Inspecting sensors every month. Yeah, pays the bills. Not exactly the freelancer motto. Yeah. Until the freelancers are back on their feet, we can enjoy all the gorgeous scenery Bastion has to offer. Flying around it is even better. <laughs> now I'm jealous, sitting here in the fort. Different alt helmet for the ranger. This Koroks look feisty today. As long as they stick to eating plants. Well, that will be really handy as a free look when you fly. The relay. Just needs a hard reset. Oh yeah, these are quick and shit. This should get the early warning network back up. Doing good, Glory. Yeah, Doing good. You'll need to manually check the sensors now. First one's nearby. Oh, maybe grab some supplies before you go. Might come in handy. Jungle's full of useful stuff. Now, I have motion blur turned off, but there's still kind of a natural motion blur here. Sorry, but the game looks good. Hey, don't be sorry. For, don't be sorry for it. <laughs> Doing whatever gravits do. I feel like that was a self-aware joke, like, hey, we have random animals that just exist. <laughs> These things are the size of people. Jesus. Through here lately. 
You're the first in months. Maps for this area. I'm going into the ravine. Oh, there's the first sensor. I need you to access it. Flying still feels really good, like a controller at least. Hang on. I'm detecting movement. Looks like mouse and keyboard. Scorpions are wild up. When aren't they? Probably haven't tasted fresh freelancer in a while. Won't be today. Aha! Convince them! Hang in there, I'm still waiting for a reading. Mostly normal. Mostly? This was the early warning system. If it's detecting something. Yeah, no sign of shaper energy. Head to the next sensor. Oh, waterfall ahead if you want to call your suit. The flat controls are a lot tighter for You're mouse and keyboard now. Check it out for me, will you? Whoops. Well. You know you probably just orphaned some baby rabbits there. Are you there when I get a reading? No sign of scorpions, at least. They're aggressive today. It doesn't feel bad on PC, but it definitely feels better around controller. Why are all the birds leaving? I'm working on it. Got a reading. Not good. Possible shaper energy detected. Get to the next sensor, we can narrow it down. Birds might have had the right idea. The guns feel really good. Honestly, I don't know, I need to I need to kinda of put more time in the PC. PC controls so far are doable. But it's gonna take practice, maybe. I don't know, maybe I just got used to the controller from the demo because I started using this more. But so far the control the PC controls are a lot more responsive versus the demo. They definitely they definitely tightened them a bit. But uh I don't know, some for the first time ever a shooter game actually feels more natural on a controller. Probably just because it's better optimized for it, but I don't know. It's definitely doable on PC though. They like, don't. It's just, it's not like Dark Souls where it's borderline unplayable on PC. Oh, and how bad could this get? You were in the heart of rage, weren't you? Don't even think it. See these ruins? There's a theory a shaper relic flipped gravity for the day. Uh huh. Well, on my watch. Last sensors nearby. With wyverns circling. I see them. Firebreeze. We still need to get a reading. Give me a second for a reading. Heads up, more wyvern are on you. Everything's in a bad mood today. This could be their nesting area. Shouldn't be a problem for the mighty gravit killer. They, they toned down the fire damage, thank god. Being fire proc was a freaking death sentence back in the demo. An unstable relic in the area. The bad one. I've got a probable location. On it. Hard, hard, hard. Hang in there, your javelin can take some heat. Mostly. And uh, when it can't, um, you'll know it.
Watertight seals are holding. Shall I call in more freelancers? No time. We can't risk this getting worse. Swimming. Swimming feels about the same with controller. Here we go. I don't know, that, that was kind of a straight shot, so... Going to a deeper... Deeper underwater cave. Your javelin can hold three at a time. That's it. A fragment of anthem energy gone astray. Okay. You're getting the hang of it. The suit can only hold three at a time. Take these over to the door. There's shotguns, okay. It's working. But you'd have to ask an arcanist why. You'll need more echoes. That should be enough. Let's see if the door opens. Aha! That did it. Great. Impressive. Even for a shaper ruin. What's it for? Raise a mountain, carve out an ocean, spawn some... New monstrosity? There has to be some reason for it all. It's the riddle of our world. And this one's waking up. I detect intense energy deeper in. Sound design in this game is pretty cool. Someone else made it down here. Though it doesn't look like they made it back out. What's all this? Got me! Painful looking? This room's never been mapped. Gonna go off a limb and say if I fly into that, I am gonna hurt. Something I can do is, you know, review the javelins, abilities, stats, perks. I've lost flight control. I'm trying to reset. Hang on. Oh, good. It's just water. Owen, controls restored. You're back. That's the relic up there. Big one too. You'll need to silence it. Where do I start? Some echoes have shaken loose. Find them and get them back in place. So, let's like they removed the little radar you have for this kind of stuff. Come on. You know the drill, you'll need more. So, yeah. Those are really big exploration areas. Finding these things are going to be kind of a pain in the ass. Um, roof situation technically never got better, but since we moved, um, what's the relic doing? No I longer can't situation. Tell the energy pockets getting bigger. Something's forming in there. What is it? I mean, anything is possible. Look at the waterfalls; they're going backwards. Just think, the anthem's being harvested in there. Pure creation, something totally new forming. New and dangerous. Lay that on the shapers. It's still amazing. Oh, you did. How are you doing, man? It's got a lot colder. Yeah, that's not a good sign. It's drawing energy to form a cataclysm. There, last 
Decker. You did it. That should silence it. It didn't hold. I see. Damn, it's starting. You've got company. Owen, talk to me. Yes, I'm trying to work it out. Shaper energy's still increasing. These are just a warm-up. The premium's oh, with thanks. cataclysm. Doesn't feel like a warm-up. I told you anything's possible. You, you've got to power through it, Nate, or else it's going to get a whole lot worse. Got anything yet? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. All right, hang in there. I might have an idea. Just give me a second. I'm clear, Owen. Good. I think we can still stop this. Those fragments of the relic that blew out? Grab them and put them back together. Oh, and fun wrinkle, more companies on the way. Go. Now carry it over and put it in place. You know, the tutorial will have been nice now in the, the demo. Keep at it and you'll survive this. Almost certainly. A lot of people did not know what to do with this kind of stuff. This is just a, this is basically just a tutorial. All I can say for sure, but I hope it's not the grab it over there. What's happening in there? There's something! Has tea! Lots of them! Hurry! How many teeth? Size is the real problem. What's that mean? Why is that thing pretty good? <laughs> okay, last one. Here goes. Careful. Anything's possible. I know, I know. You know, I heard a relic made a guy vanish into thin air once. No idea where he went. Which isn't as lucky as the freelancer whose guts were turned inside out. How's that lucky? At least he died and got it over with. This is a pain. They all are. Indecipherable puzzles that only make sense to shapers. No, I mean, there's ice jamming it up. <laughs> We're out of time! Silence it! I'm trying to! Well, nobody told him! It's an Ursix! It's not working! I'll put it back into it! Got it! Now I've got a new story. That time a relic spawned a giant Essex that almost ate you whole. Yeah. Classic for the ages. I'd say that fulfills the contract. Time to get back to Fort Tarsus. To a job. Well done. The only kind there is. I'm on my way. Hell card. Okay, well, there's a tutorial for you. That's how you do tutorials. I'm talking to my microphone when the camera's over there. <laughs> okay, so this is the same. Is Warframe more grindy or is Anthem... Well, I don't know, Genghis. I just got past the tutorial. I can't make a judgment yet. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is about as far as game journalists are gonna get. back from the demo was a freaking beast. Like, the, the, the heavy pistol was unnecessarily too good.
Select your face for your pilots. Fine. Okay. I was told this wasn't too important because uh, you're hardly going to see your character like ever. So it's not that uh, big a deal. Well, all these guys are basically generic face number 36. <laughs> generic, the generic male face number 36 dash 7, you know. It looks like, that looks like me when I get out of bed. Except, you know. Looks like me if I actually exercised or was like eventually attractive or anything. Uh, Fort Tarsus, the last stop on the Bastion frontier. If it isn't my favorite freelancer, I hear you've been busy. Ah, you know how it is, though. Another day, another disaster averted. What have you done this time? Nothing. <laughs> my armor's fine. Probably. I hope. Welcome home. You should uh, swing by my amplifier in the enclave. Something wrong? No, 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 not wrong. Um, more like, uh, like fun. Drop on by whenever. Oh yeah, that's the other thing about that Origin X, the premiere thing. Um, you get the basically the highest bundle of the game. So, again, fifteen bucks a month. EA's entire game library and like every legendary, on a guard, blah blah blah, edition available. So I really can't hate that that subscription system. But uh. We'll see. I might. I only. I can only recommend them monthly, though. That way, you can opt out of it whenever you feel like it. Okay. Fort Tars. Fort Tarsus still kind of runs like ass. Well, not ass anymore, but uh, it's laggy. Not laggy. I don't know. I think it's just loading. All right. Let's see what everyone's uh afraid. Let's check what everyone's afraid of. If they'll let me. I don't think I can. No, I can't. I can't. I can't interact with the vendors yet. Yeah, I'm in ultra settings. Yeah, tar. Tarsus still runs like ass. I don't know what's wrong with Tarsus. Apparently, they never found a fix for that. Big job, yes. At least it's not crashing, so I'll give it that one. Good, good. Got to show people why we're here. Be more contact in the board to help us out. No need to tell me. Live your trust, and even our own. Don't forget it. How many resources? Yeah. You see what I mean? I mean, you picked up on that, right? Little warble. It's warbling, right? All readings fall within acceptable tolerances. You gotta look past the numbers for once in your life. Something is off. The connection is a bit fuzzy. How do you quantify fuzzy? You don't quantify fuzzy? You don't measure it. You don't count it. It's nothing like that. It's, it's a feeling. Everything okay here, Owen? Yeah, well, on your last mission, I noticed that the cipher chair was giving off some very strange feedback. All oh, readings fall within acceptable tolerances. I know it's your call, but if you ignore it and something goes wrong... I then, will you know, find an arcanist and perform a full protocol inspection on this unit. There's nothing wrong with the chair, is there? No. Why are you always stirring up trouble? What are you talking about? 
I've just done her a massive favor. You've got no idea how boring it is being a Fort Cipher. She does not get to work with a freelancer. She does not get to see the world through the eyes of a javelin pilot. No, 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 no. You know what she gets to do? She gets to relay official messages back and forth to ciphers at the Capitol day after day after day. Some people like boring. Not everyone's cut out to be a freelancer. So you have said. But you have to admit that last mission would have gone better with a partner. I have a partner. You. Every good javelin pilot needs a cipher. That is not what I meant. Look, if I had a suit of my own, I could be out there in the field with you. Hold down your boosters, Hotshot. With more training, you'll get your chance, I promise. Fine. It's not like we could afford a spare suit anyway. The job board is empty. We'll figure something out. We always do. Yeah. Do you ever regret missing out on the glory days? Back when freelancers were treated like heroes. Contracts would just fall into their laps. Everywhere they went, they were given respect. And free sandwiches. Free sandwiches? Yeah, I haven't had my lunch yet. I'm starving. We're on a tight budget here. Budget has room for sandwiches. You're probably right. You know what? Why don't you uh, head over to the forge, get your javelin tuned up so we're ready to roll if a contract does fall into our laps. I want free sandwiches. No, I don't talk during the cutscenes because, well, I'm trying to listen to what the story is. So, as far as I can understand, uh, this is the dude in my this is the dude talking in my head every mission. I don't know what that lady's job purpose something was, and yeah, freelancer reputation. Further and cause work with the open both and arise. Uh huh. There is no music playing in Tarsus like there is a, like there is in cutscenes or something. Monthly trials. The path to glory challenges before time runs out. What's a path to glory challenge? Err, point strider. Successfully complete missions. Oh, okay. Codex, basically the, well, Codex. Yeah, Tarsus, Tarsus still runs like absolute ass. Like, he, uh, he didn't put a lot of work into that. How's the game so far? We just got started. Like, I just barely got past the tutorial. I'm not casting any judgments just yet. <laughs> Who do you think I am? Time Magazine? Yeah, I know. I know Atlas. Why so much loading screens? There hasn't been any. That since I got back from the mission 10 minutes ago. Access Forge. I think I'm still in a tutorial section. Owen, you need something? What are you talking about? I just got a message from you saying to meet you at the Forge. I didn't send any. Why would I want to meet up here? Something's not right. We needed to speak in private. My name is Tassin. Do you always travel with security escorts? Not always. The Sentinels have their uses. Well, you make a hell of an entrance, I'll give you that. I have a contract for you, freelancer. I'd like to know who I'm working for before I take a job. 
Really? <laughs> From what I hear, two of you will take about any job you can get these days. What's the job? An arcanist has gone missing. Missing? I thought arcanists just hung out in labs studying Shaker relics. <laughs> Matthias Sumner was investigating some relics at a ruin near the fort. I need you to find him and bring him back home safe. If he's still alive. No one knows more about the dangers of Shaper artifacts. I'm confident that knowledge and his own resourcefulness will keep him alive until you find him. What do you say, Freelancer? Make it worth your while. Owen? Looks like the Freelancer's right again. Well, us anyway. Excuse me, I just got a... That is excellent. I will go and run my diagnostics. Let me know when you're ready to leave. It was a pleasure. On behalf of myself and Matthias, thank you for doing this. Uh, okay, and, and if I have... Fine, Matthias. Trust me. I'm a person you want to know. Okay. Who was that? Uh, motion blur is turned off. Yeah, this game kind of has a... Natural motion blur if you want it, whether if you want it or not. The fact motion blur is turned off makes me actually kind of scared to think of what it would look like with it still on. Yeah, that's all off. So that's kind of dumb. Look who's back in one piece. So, did you expect me in more pieces than one? You? Never. I trust you've brought me work. Always good to give your javelin the once over after a run. What have you done this time? Okay, her, her eyebrows go up and down now versus the demo, but she still has that thousand yard stare. Oh, you know, she, she looks to the left. You see that? She looks to the left. She's alive. Just my job. Fascinating. I never would have guessed. I just want to be sure everything's in order. That's what I like to hear. Scars, beasts, relic-based nonsense. Can't be too careful out there. I'll run you some maintenance checks, make sure everything's humming. Won't impact performance, but I'll add moisture-wicking fabric to the internal padding while I'm at it. Can't argue with that. Why would you? If you're running headfirst into chaos, may as well be comfy. I like the way you think. I have my moments. Go on. I'll run the checks while you're off. Oh. Cool. New suit is available at level 8. Okay, so this is kind of nice. You start you start your tutorial in the in the you start the tutorial with the ranger javelin. But I guess this is how you get to pick your uh, first alternative javelin. And right at the beginning of the game, so that's cool. You're not, you're not locked out of the one you really want to try right off the bat. So, nice. Oh, getting my boy Storm back. And he's a controller. How's Origin work? Do I need to pick? Um, I sell, it's, uh, what I'm doing personally, I'm using the Origin subscription thing. Origin's a premiere subscription. Um, I didn't even know about it until I was about to buy Anthem, and then they, you know, they did the whole, are you sure you want, you don't want to try? And I looked at it, and it's like, that's not a terrible idea. Essentially, you get EA's entire game library, so, you know, every Battlefield ever, you know, Battlefield ever, uh, every Star Wars title, anything, even the old games you like, and it's all the collectors, legendary, game of the year, blah, 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 editions for 15 bucks a month, 
though essentially it's like playing Final Fantasy. If you can if you can do fifteen bucks a month, you basically have two hundred games to play for free. So it's good if you play a lot of or if you play a lot of EA games like Battlefield and all that, but it's not really worth it if all you play is like one game, one or two games from Steam every other day. So you kinda, you kinda gotta look into it yourself. Huh? They they skipped they skipped the wait or unless they just missed it, but I think they skipped the whole like conversation explaining the jab when when you unlock it. That stinks. Hey Davey, how you doing man? Uploading. Nice. Yeah, if you if you have like a well of course this is only on PC, so I was gonna say if you have console you might want to get a hard copy, but um the origin premiere thing's only on PC. But yeah, if you if you're on console, then I'd say just get the hard copy. Don't don't do a digital don't do a digital download. That way, you can at least refund it. That's what I always say. I don't know if the store is accessible yet. Definitely specific. I did all this before. Blah, blah, blah. Huh. So my first guess right now is some cosmetics you can't buy with real money. Like you, you can only buy some certain cosmetics with in-game money. That's good. It, that, that means there can be a really good helmet or whatever out there and the game just flat out says, no, you can't buy it. You have to actually go work for it. So, all right. I can live with that. Into game. Uh, no, we're only 55 minutes into the game. I have the timer up there. Make sure you've got what you need. I don't, I don't think I have any abilities, so you might as well just head out. Bad joke, sir. I can find Dark Wolf. Alright. I'll just pick I'll just pick some colors because uh I'd rather not I'd rather not go out there looking like I just crawled out of a dumpster. I think it's just 4k gold in general to start off with. Not much skull, not much. Uh, so far the game is okay. I can't really make a judgment just yet. I think we, we just kind of barely got past the tutorial, so everything's still kind of in the air.
Okay, yeah, so some stuff... Some stuff you can only get with in-game coins. That just confirmed it. While others have, like, a ore with this much. So... 300, 300 shards for a vinyl. I don't know if that's a lot or a little. Yeah, Mass Effect reference. Um, I think I'm going to be playing with a squad for the moment. Or, I don't, I don't know if I have a choice in the matter. One of those kind of, like, always online games. But, um... I think you can only get shards via microtransactions, yeah, but let's see. You have all the, you have practically all the texture in the world if you want, just right off the bat. This is the only stuff you can actually buy. Did you view their currency prices? Um, not yet. I tried, but all the vendors were locked because I'm still like in the tutorial section. Oh, let's, let's get let's get more into it. This is full release. This. If you have Origin Premiere, you basically get early access. Not, er, not early access, early release. It's a full game, it's not early, it's not in... Not ac it's not in alpha or anything like that, this is what the finished product is. This is also before any patching or anything, so keep that in mind, but... Yeah, so far everything's working and looking pretty good. Uh, again, my only, gripe, my only gripe right now is that Fort Tarsus is still really bare. As a cosmetic thing, it's still pretty. It's, it's kind of a dead city, but I think it's. I think that's supposed to be the case. I don't know if it's going to grow as you progress the game, because right now the story is hinting that this place is like a dying city, like all the freelancers left. So you, you know, they lost all their currency, and it's basically a dead trading town at this point. So it's. It might get more people as you grow over time, and Data Feud just confirmed my theory. <laughs> so there you go. Because right now it's like this place's economy is like total shit. I mean, you're, you're apparently this place's only freelancer, so yeah. As you progress, maybe this place gets more popular and more traders come in, and then it gets more fuller. So we'll wait. We'll see. Okay, yeah. So Data Feud just confirmed my confirmed my theory then. Still can't still can't access the micro store yet, so you have to hold your horses for that one. Hit the pause button and right bumper. I just win my javelin. I'll check it next time. Loading screen still cuts that animation off. That's kind of dumb. <laughs> I've never seen that full animation except in like promotional trailers. Before you can create a voice out in your radio speaker. Um, yeah, Paradoy. Um, or Paradoy. Parody. Parody. Um, 
Yeah, I've had that thrown at me before a few times. My voice is very suited for voice work or radio work and all that. It's a it's an option. It's it's something I can you know go walk into a place and go okay. Want a voice? I am. Well then. Let's not keep that big bad world waiting. Our contract is to locate an arcanist named Matthias. Tassin has given us the last location where he made contact. Sutters. The location Tassin gave us must be close. I'm detecting the camp's shortwave radio. Broken equipment. Arcanist made. And no Matthias. Oh, hang on. Detecting another radio. Same frequency. Must be more than one camp. Let's follow that signal. They definitely, they definitely improved the lighting. Okay, I've got a new trail. We'll need to get to the location I've marked for better reception. Anything else I should know? Oops. Besides the Starter Matthias there. get themselves in trouble by being out here. About Matthias. Brilliant and reckless. He has a reputation among the Arcanists. Not a good one. Having a bad reputation is chapter one of the Freelancer's Handbook. signal is getting stronger. Clearly, Matthias established more than one camp. Arcanist located. They're dead. There's still no sign of Matthias. Look for anything that can help track him down. Oh, there's a little radar thing. It seems like the game stutters whenever it needs to load more of the area. It might be because I'm streaming on OBS, but uh because OBS takes a lot of computer power. We can use it to locate Matthias. But uh what do you call it? When when I do my like initial review video, I'll take a note if it works better while I'm not streaming or not. Too long, and it's too quiet. It's not as hard as it was on the demo. Finally, and done. Then the demo was playing hard mode, so. Booster. 
a bunch of scars. I've never seen this much scar activity. What is going on? I don't know, but it's not a good sign. Yeah, I'm gonna we're gonna have to run a test if um game is stuttering like this normally or if it's just because I'm streaming. Looks like they're using gates. I hate those. Very unfair. Close. All you need to do is turn it on. Yeah, organic. Uh, that, is working. that was a problem in the last in the demo. Scars in pursuit. Matthias, he still can't hear us. I've got a location. Like there would be so much shit happening that you wouldn't be able to see what was going on. So, let's see if that's still a problem or not. Taking it apart. We fixed that. I bet we reach Matthias. What's happening with the scars? Something has them enraged. That seems to be the last of the scars. Let's fix that radio. What needs to happen? Get me into the access panel, I'll do the rest. Access panel open. Starting repairs. I think it's because this mission is based in the open world area, and the open world area is stuttering real bad because it's trying to load everything. It might be on my end though, so again, I'm not jumping the bullet, but uh, we'll see what happens. I don't know if it's going to be locked on 30 frames or not, I haven't really... Follow, follow the console. Build. Oh hi. Focus on the big guy. Oh, the gates are closing. Looks like we scared them off. Let's take care of the rest and get back to the radio. Ha! <laughs> okay, I think I got it. Are you sure? Mostly sure. Oh, these are like these are like ant hill terminate. It's working. Terminite Hills. Location. Patch him with eyes through. I'm calling anyone in the area. I need help. There are scars everywhere. They're oh, they hurt. Jeez. Matthias, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Thank goodness. There's no time. I'm hiding, but the scars are searching. I, I can see them. You must hurry. Just hang on. We're coming. It's 
smoother stream than Young Yi. I don't know who Young Yi is, but uh, cool. <laughs> Termite locust bees. I guess that's what they're called now. That's what I'm calling them. Pests. Yeah, there we go. Pests. Can you hear me? Yes. I'm here. I'm getting a read on this radio signal. Are you okay? A little banged up, but fine. You see that ramp up ahead? The one with the statue? Head up there. Oh, so wait. If... Allies pick up resources, I think we get it too. That's nice. What about the scars near you? See anything? Not a few spots of trouble. Near misses. They're quite relentless. Wait, what's this? I found some canisters. Hmm. Could prove useful. Don't try anything dangerous. Not to worry. It'll be a contained explosion. I think you better hurry. Dealing with some scars ahead. Put less for the thighs. That's good. Shop, I have to take a mission to gain three embers. Coin gain is coin gain is decent. First, like, non tutorial mission. We've reached the tunnel. You're close. Main chamber just ahead. It's incredible. There's a slight, there's a slight aim assist to the controllers. It's nice, because it's, it's, it's actually really nice. It's like, it's not really abruptive like Red Dead Redemption where like it snaps your camera to the enemy. But like, if you're in it, if you're actively aiming at the enemy, it kinda, kinda just gently pulls your crosshair towards them. How did you make them so mad, Matthias? I don't know, never seen them like this. We got 
got some scar heavies. Could use some help. This is one of those cases where too many abilities make you unable to see what's going on. It is, but it looks dangerous. Rust Reaver. His name is Rust Reaver. I don't care what its name is. Be the only one using their health or anything. That thing just isn't done. What the hell? The Scarlet is down. Let's clean up the rest of them now, shall we? over Shaper sites, but nothing like this. I must tell Tassin. Please. I need to return to Fort Tarsus. Emotes aren't on a scroll wheel anymore. You just, they're assigned to up, right, and down. That makes more sense, I guess. If you can only hold three emotes, you might as well just assign them to the button. Artillery. We still don't know what these metals mean. <laughs> slot. Nice. Okay. Cool. So leveling has a purpose in this game. Like, you don't just start off with all your gimmicks right off the bat. You, you, you need to work up to get your stuff. That's that's good time gating because that means you don't you're not gonna blow through the game, but you do get to watch yourself progress. There's a reason to keep going for the time being at least. Oh, there's two options there. I'm not sure I picked. <laughs> Why does ranged DPS javelin get involved get involved in frames? Uh I'm not sure you I'm not sure what you're asking. Freelancer. Thanks for the save. That trouble was unexpected. You often hang around outside the walls like that? Occupational hazard, but this was different. Something's making the scars more violent. I think it's the Dominion. We think they're back. I'm sure you must know Freelancer Yaro. 
I think Tassin's right. This feels like before the attack on Freemark. The one that set off the Heart of Rage? I don't really know the whole story. I do. That's in time. Much of what I am about to tell you is not well known. My ward, Johnny, was there ten years ago. She saw it with her own eyes. What you will already know is that Freemark was one of the great cities of Bastion. Ancient, proud, prosperous. But most important, it held the largest and greatest enclave of freelancers anywhere. The freelancers, along with the Sentinels, guardians of the walls, protected Freemark and its people from the chaos of our world. Until one day, the Dominion arrived on their doorstep. Cruel conquerors from the north. Star Wars vibes from this. The Dominion, the Sentinels, and the Freelancers would make their claim for Freemark that day. Each group heirs in their own right to the legendary General Tarsis and her Legion of Dawn. One of our best, Freelancer Adams, led the charge as the Enclave leapt to meet the Dominion forces head on. My Johnny says the army was massive. The Dominion was led by Dr. Harkin, a man never seen before or after that day. He came to take the city at any cost. So they fought, outnumbered, outflanked, and outgunned. Free Lancers fought. They did well for a time. I like kind of want a battlefield theme of this game now. <laughs> but the walls of the Great Free Mark did not hold. The Dominion poured in. Adams, with many freelancers, made their last stand outside the city walls. While some, like Johnny, stayed to help who she could. When, without warning, the doomed sentinels fell back. But now I tell you that deep in the city, Johnny discovered what the Sentinels already knew. The Dominion didn't want to destroy Freemark. They wanted to capture an ancient Shaper relic that was protected deep inside the city. The Cenotaph. I think these soldiers are a bit under leveled. You guys can fly. <laughs> it seems this Dr. Harkin believed he had created a way for the Dominion to use the Cenotaph to control the Anthem of Creation itself. Arrogance. The Anthem 
will not be controlled. The terrible cataclysm, which was unleashed that day, destroyed Freemark, destroyed the Dominion, destroyed everything. That cataclysm became the heart of rage. Some survived to tell the story of Freemark, but not many. Dominion must be back for a reason. I clearly have more intel to hunt down. Come and find me later. Yeah, me too. I'll contact you when I have something. I'll be in the Enclave. Okay. A little bit of a, a little bit of an exposition dump, but uh, nice visuals. Always good to see a nice cutscene, at least mixed in between here and there. Hey there. I figured you'd make your way to me soon enough. You're the new freelancer I've been hearing about. Only the good parts. <laughs> oh, it's all good. The fact that anybody's talking about a freelancer is even better. Name's Prospero. I'm betting you're the one I've been waiting for. Yeah? Why's that? You understand being a freelance is more than just a job. It's about pride. Pride in doing something well. Pride in your javelin. Hasn't been much of that lately. Intolerable. Who wants to charge into a fight looking plain and simple? What kind of statement does that make? Not when you could fly in looking like steel thunder come to life. A fistful of lightning in one hand and a hailstorm of pain in the other. That's colorful. Is what I do. When lances want to make a statement, they buy something special for their javelin. Maybe custom decals or bodywork. I'm the guy they come to. We're used to. Hasn't been any demand. The Forge can't even build anything these days. I'm hoping you can change that. How can I help? We need to fire it up again. That takes Ember. And someone with the guts to collect it. If you can find some, I'm back in business. We both are. I'll teach you how to craft things. Okay, I'll buy it. What I wanted to hear, you'll need to search for Ember outside the fort. Bring it here and we can start getting this place back on its feet. Will do. So, what I'm assuming is the microtransaction store needs to actually, like, unlock. <laughs> oh, free play unlocked. There you go. I wonder if they're like they're trying to make they're trying to make the they're trying to make the uh microtransaction store like further into the game that way people like, like Angry Joe don't just, you know, dive headfirst into it just so they can yell about the prices before they even do anything with the game. First, then again, they're probably just blasting through the game, not even looking at anything that's happening. But, we'll see. Also, like, yeah, let me see something, because this motion blur is, like, it's awful. Oh, you said this was the store. Okay, so based off that, based off that leak, you know, a big leak that went out with an angry fucktard making a giant fearmonger campaign, um, they increased the coins, but decreased the shards. Can't really tell if that's better or worse. It depends how much coins you get. I like I, I started off with forty thousand, but I don't know. I need to see how many coins you get based off missions. Oh, get shards. It's
at them. Okay, so yeah, it's a hunt. It's a hundred, roughly a hundred shards per, a hundred shards per dollar. Give or take. So, given the so textures, the skin decals, emotes, three to four dollars. Actual flat, actual full armor packs. Uh, eight nine dollars. So <laughs> that's not terrible. A little high for my tastes, but it ain't terrible. We'll see how much you can get for coins. Like I said, I'm not make I'm not making any judgment calls yet. I need to get into the game. No food. Food critics don't smell the food and then say if it's good or bad or not. They gotta actually taste it. Um, I don't know, Zizzle. I got 40k. I don't, I don't even know where the 40k came from. I think it just came from starting the game. I don't know where this other coin came from. Alright. So, hold on. Okay, this is with this is with motion blur on. Is it just me or did it look, does it look like motion blur just got turned off? This is like a lot better. Not perfect, but better. Yeah, huh, um, that's weird. <laughs> okay, so the, the churn, to churn the motion blur off, you need to churn it on. Ploy the moment. Oh, cynic cynical. Give your, uh, give my, give my regards to your buddy. What branch is he in? Then if I turn depth of field on, it'll turn off in game? Greens, nice. I think my dad was was Marine. I'm not, I can't remember. It's been forever. My dad was either an army or Marines. What? I want to say army. I, I remember Marines being thrown out there.
Alright, uh, his knees got stuck. When do you think the first patch of the game is going to be launched? Probably today. Games rarely go the first day without some kind of patch. Besides some stuttering, I haven't gotten a whole lot of bugs, per se. Just, uh... You know, again, just the occasional, like, stutter, like, the game. Like, the game's trying to load something, and it, it pauses for a second. But, um, as far as that goes, no real... No real, uh... Hiccups or anything. So, re... Remastered? <laughs> How you doing? A screen shake option? I didn't see one. I'll look in the mission. Uh, but, uh, people, people are gonna bash the shit out of this game either for it being Warframe, a, a competitor to Warframe, or just for being associated with EA. You know, I'm, I, I want to, I want to be, and I kind of call myself a game critic. Also, let me switch the webcam while I can still do that. Um, never mind, my mouse is locked for now. But you know, I'm a, I'm a gamer, I'm a critic first, and a gamer second. And that might sound bad, but it's like. I want to make sure my critiques are fair, honest, and accurate. So I'm not just, I'm not just going to give this game a base, you know, 2 out of 10 for being associated with EA, or 4 out of 10 not Warframe enough, you know. I'm going to see how this game does on its own. Okay, Freelancer, let's see what trouble we can get into today. Keep me updated. Uh, don't see anything for green shake. Yep, green shake screen shake isn't an option. That's that stuttering I'm talking about. Juiced. That's something I kept kind of pointing out was how uh, I found it really funny when people were like saying how oh EA EA is terrible because loot boxes etc. Meanwhile, people have already spent like thousands and thousands of dollars on loot boxes from a EA's Apex Legends. Like. You kind of mess up the whole because it's free argument when you spent a hundred bucks on a five percent chance for a skin you want. doing um controller it's still it's better but 
we're talking better from already good, so... Yeah, this game is really starting to show how it was made for controller more than anything. Uh... Mouse and keyboard... Actually, before I forget again, um... I just get hit. Oh. Game might have froze. Yep, froze. All right, first crash. Hour forty minutes in, first crash. <laughs> yeah, Hannah, what the heck? <laughs> ah. Cool. Alright, um, well, that, get, that gives me an opportunity to at least switch over my camera. Uh, go over here. Flip. Flip it. Yep, game shit itself. Oh well. Uh, let's see, let's see. Uh, some is not responding, I noticed. Alright. I'm gonna be okay with kick keyboard and mouse over sensitivity isn't as bad when I'm going to. Alright, well, Marco, good to know. I don't know how to flip my camera, so I'm just gonna be I'm gonna be like a just gonna be staring at this wall over here. Just uh Yep. That's a good game over there. <laughs> Wait, actually can I do this? figure out later. But, uh, let's see. Oh, let's... Okay. So I can just rejoin, at least. At least, it... I'm happy at least it crashed. If it froze, I'm happy it froze during just a gathering mission. Not uh, during a cutscene. That would have sucked. But, uh, I was gonna try mouse and keyboard. Mouse and keep I the the controller controls are definitely better. There's, there's no getting around that. It's it's like Dark Souls. Like this game is made for controllers. You you can do mouse and keyboard, but you're gonna have an infinitely easier time on a controller. But um the keyboard and mouse controls aren't awful, they're just more sensitive, I guess that's the best word. Uh, reading an old comment. Oldest son yep, is really enjoying good. Apex. I'll start combing through reports and see where we're needed most. Alright, let me know. You know, that's a par that's a parenting strategy I promote so well. Make your kids buy their own stuff. You know, give them a give them a freebie here and there. I mean, you know, they gotta make they, they can only they can, they can only make so much money. But when it comes to stuff like that, you know, like Apex and skins and all that kind of stuff, make them save their own money and they can get it themselves. 
That's always a good lesson, in my opinion. Alright, so I'm going to use mouse and keyboard controls and see how this goes. Camera aim sensitivities are default at the moment. I haven't changed them or anything yet. For me, the, the flying controls are basically the same as a uh, the World War II semi play called War Thunder. That's probably why I'm so used. To, I'm very used. To, probably why I'm very familiar with them, or why I got very familiar with them really quickly, because they're essentially the same as War Thunder. You know, you, you have a crosshair and you have where you're going and where you're aiming, and they kind of just coincide with each other. Well, it's easier with this game because in War Thunder you have to control a rudder and rudder flaps in an uh, elevator. Hey, those guys, those guys hit like a truck. Storm, storm flies a whole lot longer. He's the only one that can really effectively hover. Sentinels in bad shape. They need your help. Scar heading this Ooh, way. Oh, that's and fast. That can't be good. I wonder if it's a lag. Is it? I can't tell if it's my system or if it's a lag or for the stutter because ODI, how you doing man? This is so OP in this game. <laughs> Alright, Cynical. Thanks for dropping by, man. I really can't tell though if it's my computer or if it's lag, but the controls actually like took a shit when I held the mouse and keyboard just now. Like there was like input lag and stuff, so 
Oh no, I can't tell if that's the game or if that's just my system. I have to ask about that. Yeah, I feel like it's more I feel like it's more of the game than me because this is the only game this is the only game that has a problem with that. Skill said the same thing. Okay, so, uh, let's see. You know, this, I don't know if it's just because of its night, but, uh, I think there's, like, there's a little, just a little bit, but there's a little bit more people around here right now. Hey, Prospero. I know you got good news. All the ember you need. What I wanted to hear. All right, then. Let's get to business and fire up the forge. It's time all these javelins around here got the tender loving care they deserve. Head on over to the forge, and you can start crafting. But don't forget, when you want to make a statement, maybe polish that javelin up with a nice coat of pain and thunder. Come see me. So, you're the thunder merchant, huh? Hey, the best freelancers always arrive with a bang. But first, they buy it from me. Don't be a stranger. Okay, so this is the cat. This is the cash shop. Right? Not just the cash shop. It looks like this is just the general shop in general. Good timing. We just got some excellent new stuff. Oh, here's all my stuff. Uh, Afro, it's, um, it's, it's doing pretty good. It's, a little, a little hiccupy here and there. That's where we're running. We had one freeze just recently. Um, it's not. It's looking pretty good. It's not looking. It's not. It's not as bad as the demo. I'll put it that way. I can. I can say it with confidence. It's uh, definitely a step up from the demo. Okay. I got two. I got two thousand coins from that last expedition we just did. I think. I, I keep. I keep not paying attention to where I'm getting all my money from. But if I get that many coins just from doing a four-minute chore in the free play room, then yeah, the cash, the cash shop isn't even going to hardly be a thing. Like you're, I can. I can only. I can only see people buying shards if they really. Really wanted something right here, right now, and didn't want to farm for it. We've been playing for almost two hours now. I have another job for you. I'm flattered, but I still don't really know you. Old habit. I work for Corvus. Ah, a spy. 
My job is to keep tabs on threats to Fort Tarsus. I have an agent embedded with the regulators, a group of smugglers. She keeps the really dangerous stuff from the wrong buyers. But her last report said there'd been an incursion of foreign operatives in the area. Who are they? Like I said before, I'm betting Dominion. Which means trouble's coming our way. Big trouble, if you're right. I think trouble's your idea of fun. Start by meeting my agent at a regulator camp here. Learn what else she knows and go from there. We'll get it done. Let's see. Uh... Hello, H Hello, H1. I hear the messages about Warframe. What happened today? The Nora Knight. I haven't heard anything about that. I, have, I haven't heard anything about any Nora Knight. Ring a bell. I just, for any, for context, for anyone who's, um, we just got my internet rehooked up today from the move. I, my room's still, like, in pieces, but, um, yeah, I just got hooked up today, like, so I haven't been, I haven't been keeping up with anything for, like, the past four days. Would you just look at the market lately? It's so sad to see the empty stalls. Let's see. You know, it's a really two sided coin so far with the voice acting and the animations. Static voice acting or static uh, conversations when it comes to this place. It's pretty, yeah, it's pretty, like I said, lifeless puppet. And all these NPCs basically just have a thousand yard stare and they just move their eyebrows up and down to express emotion. But then you have the actual like mission cutscenes where it's actually done really damn well. So it's like it's kinda it's kinda noticeably distracting when you when you have a encounter conversation and a script a scripted cutscene conversation. Earlier you mentioned something of not viable as shards, but is that the you know, only by rotation or a shop? Um, Destral, I... what do you call it? From what I can tell, some things like helmets, but there's gonna be some things that are like permanently, permanently available to you, like alt helmets, armor pieces, that are just always there, you get it when you feel like it. And it seems like there's like a it seems like there's some kind of special deals page, which is the feature here. Apparently, this stuff gets rotated in ten days. So it's uh, it's kind of mixed. Some things like this, like a, some things like this, are going to be in rotation. Other things are going to be uh, permanent. on the game right now um up to this point it's solid it raised my eyebrows a few times and it it, it raised my eyebrows a few times at uh certain little nitpicks i can find here and there but so far it's just solid still too early to say warframe six anniversary it's fast approaching to keep off celebrations, get ready to declare war, a weekend war. Uh huh. Thanks, so skins about Warframe. Yeah, skins are about Warframe levels. Now, gen skins, at least, yeah. Well, actually, certain skins in Warframe are what? 300 ish platinum? How much is 300 platinum? That's $15, right? Ish. The game got released for people with Origin access, like me on PC. Um, it's not globally out yet. 
That's on the 22nd. Last week ago? No, it didn't. It just, it just launched this morning. The demo was weeks ago, but this is the actual, like, full game. I'm tempted to put the difficulty on hard to get better loot, but um, I think I'll do that when I get people I actually can talk to, like the Zazel or someone. No problem, Odin and I. Um, you start, you start, start with the ranger, like the beginning, tra the beginning, like tutorial cutscene. You're your ranger, but your first, like actual, in mission, you pick a, you get to pick one javelin to start off with. So, um, technically, you can, you can pick your first javelin pick to be with the one you want to try the most. I've got the map coordinates from Tassin. You're headed for a regulator camp. Her agent will be there? Undercover. Tassin gave me a picture so we can identify her. There's snipers in the game, but it's kind of like Warframe. Each javelin can use any weapon. So, what's the latest intel but, um, on regulators? Blossus so is, is the only one that can use heavy be. weapons. Anything of value is fair game. So, Plus the usual rumors of secret hideouts in the area. They have to keep all that stuff somewhere. Question is, why would the Dominion be involved? I hope Tassel's wrong about that. I'm not looking forward to being a wartime cipher. Okay, you're not far from the regulator camp. Should be coming up soon. Keep an eye out. We're skirting the edge of Scar territory. We've got trouble. The camp's been overrun. I'm clearing them out. I forgot to put on the second pistol. Or second weapon. Looks like you've got dead regulators there. Oh, can you identify Tassin's agent? Uh, I'm not seeing her. Could still be alive. I don't think animals killed these people. Is there anything useful at the site? Some kind of recording there. Dominion have attacked the camp. I can't reach Tassin. I'm looking for the regulator hideout at these coordinates. That was Tassin's agent. I'll need to decrypt the coordinates and hang on, scars on the move.
bosses can't use pistols or SMGs. Oh. They're never gonna leave us alone, are they? They've been out for blood since we rescued Matthias. The Otas is right. It has to be the Dominion stirring the pot. Have a waste of an ult. <laughs> demo was like don't don't hold your ultimate for like you know a special moment you're gonna you're gonna get to use your ultimate a lot in this game so you know, don't 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 like just hoard it for nothing be sure about this taking on the dominion isn't like fighting a pack of wolven when evil people knock on your door you don't hide you kick their ass back to whatever hole they crawled out of Mm. Stop the fire before it spreads. Fort Tarsus cannot become another free mark. Some dead regulators outside the cave. Maybe they were defending their hideout. I guess Dominion don't take prisoners. So awesome question. Fly, um, there is a fly, you fly technically forever, but you have to keep yourself cool. So, staying around water, going flying in down directions. Um, oh, I can talk down. What's happening? Yeah, I'm seeing that you're in some kind of yeah. field, has to be affecting your suit. If you fly up too much, you overheat faster. If you fly down, hey, smugglers cool cave, down. It would seem. Anything you could want for a price. Looks like that includes shaker relics. my system or if it's lag but yeah the stuttering the stuttering is is back it was gone in the demo but it's back so I'm gonna look into that one and there we are the Dominion yeah and they've got Tassin's agents best lie low we know it's here! I... I don't know what you mean. Then I'll show you. No. That's not how we conduct business. I find that pain is no substitute for money. So let's negotiate. The relics not for sale. <laughs> See? Progress. You do have it. Now name your price, and we all walk away with something. Relics are dangerous. Only if you're careless. Do I look careless? What is that? We found the relic! A pity for you. Negotiations have concluded. You bastard! Oh, well, now this is awkward. A freelancer. How oh, useless. I fought your kind before, and I put them in the ground. You'll be joining them. Does that guy now like a Storm Colossus, uh... Hyper. Come on. 
believe this. Are we really in a firefight with Dominion? But I am. You're sitting in a chair somewhere. Not used to having professional soldiers shooting us. Scars, maybe, but not like this. Well, it's work on both, huh? I didn't say it wasn't exciting. Just be careful. You did it. But what about Tassin's agent? She's still alive. Is she still alive after she just had a bolt of lightning she strike her in the it. face? No. But there's an archive here. I see it. Looks damaged from the fight. Maybe it, Tassin He's make very sense much not still this alive. This can't be for nothing. What about the one they called the monitor? He took the relic. And I'm getting it back. These were classic Dominion tactics. Total carnage and no witnesses. What are they doing this far south? I don't know, but it involves relics. That won't end well. My javelin's grounded again. It's that shield generator. Push them back. We can't let them interfere. Watch it. Looks like the monitor left a cleanup crew behind. Try to disable that machine. I have the specs. I think I can override it. Hold here. I'll try to deactivate it. Great place to die, Owen. Oh, they haven't let you down. Did you get to pick a word from him or a word? Um, yes. No mercy, yeah, no mercy, uh, you get to pick it. It starts you off with the ranger at the beginning tutorial, but then you get to pick it on the first mission. Oof, that's the last of them. I can still catch the monitor. Better hurry, he's gonna hit start. Actually, yeah, this game is rated T. Only T-rated games have microtransactions? Uh, no. Not seen a phone game? Others are... And the others are locked behind... Grid? Well, they're locked behind... They're lo the others are locked... You get to pick... I think, he's, I think you can still outside. keep the I ranger, we can track. but you get to pick the line. one you want, and then you get the rest on leveling. I get the next. I get to pick another one at level eight, so we're already almost what halfway there, more than halfway there. There you go. You can't be too far. Dominion must have big plans for a guy like the monitors in our neighborhood. We just need to make sure he never comes back. You see, this is why I want to be out there with you. Show bad people the door. Not as easy as it looks. Okay, show bad people the door at the end of a very large gun. Still got a trail. Keep it up. We might have a shot at this. That's all we need. Just ahead. 
lot of Dominion. Where's the monitor? Checking. To reason? Talk it out? Does this look like they dropped by for tea? I'm, I'm not seeing you. I'm getting a bad feeling here. I think maybe this was an ambush. Big letters here! Damn! Time to show them that really large gun. Hey, watch it! Another one of the monitor's lieutenants. Okay, it's over. Score one for the freelancers. Yes. Congratulations on walking straight into my trap. Owen? Owen, what's happening? I don't know. He's... Obviously more powerful than you. I think it's important to take a measure of one's adversary. And I find you... Lacking. Yeah. Ask your lieutenants how they feel. All oh, right, you can't, because I put them down. Freelancers boast of courage they never have. It's why they're extinct. I'm alive and well, you son of a... He's gone. Save your breath. Let's head back to the fort. I'll let Tassin know we need to talk. Yeah, this back there reminds me of something, but I can't remember what. It reminds me of Ultron slightly from Avengers. I'm pretty sure it's Ultron. I'm pretty sure that's what I'm thinking of. He has that smug but calcul he has that smug but calculative personality thing going on. So this, this is what I think people were compared to as a relay in Warframe, not just a everything meshed together type of HUD hub. I don't know why it took me here. Oh, I think this is like... I think it'll take you here after a mission. 
That way, if you want, you can just jump right back and forth missions. So that way you can kind of just skip Tarsus altogether. But you need to go back to Fort Tarsus for uh, story stuff, I guess. Yeah. I haven't seen a case where like there you can have multiple missions on at once yet though. Oh, this is the... okay. Power 18. Okay. Well, I just confirmed a theory. Um, so people were saying... As people were saying, isn't it kind of pay to win if you pre-order the Legion of Dawn? If you get the Legion of Dawn edition and you get a weapon for it, isn't that kind of pay to win? And yeah, my suspicions were correct. It's... it's not a good weapon. <laughs> It's a good weapon to start off with, like for the beginning missions, but um, based off what I saw in the demo, we're gonna you'll outgrow this really fast. Like by by the time you're done with the first couple chapters of the game, you're gonna have way better equipment than this. Kind of funny because it counts as it counts as a uh, like a masterworks weapon, but it, <laughs> it's not. It's probably the weakest masterworks weapon in the game. Does it scale? No, weapons don't scale. It'll be like this for the entirety of its existence. So yeah, it's it's just a like as Azel put it, a newbie gun. You get it just to you know have a little boost for the beginning tutorial when you're getting your ass kicked when you don't know how to play the game yet, and then you just dump it when you find something when you find something better. It is a pretty good perk for the storm, that's true. Don't see any LOD stuff. LOD? What's that mean? Oh, Legion of Dawn, okay. Um, well, that, that that gun was Legion of Dawn. Um, I haven't put any of this stuff on yet. Yeah, I got, I got the Legion of Dawn stuff already. I just haven't equipped it yet. 
Okay, we got the wall back. Oh, okay. Never mind. Now here's where it gets fun. Time to make a statement. I kind of like the default helmet better. Can you reclaim the weapon if you trash it? I haven't trashed anything yet, so I'm not sure. But, um... I'd like to imagine if you trash something... If you trash something, it's probably not going to come back. <laughs> to get this. <laughs> hey Kodai, how you doing man? Let's see. I don't think I think they didn't put a background so you can actually see your color of your javelin. Kind of the reason it's kind of like what people do when they put the background in, like you know, some people put a picture in the back of their warframes in the arsenal. It's that trick where like the camera kind of puts your warframe in front of the, it zooms into the picture, but it puts the warframe in front of it because camera physics. You guys know what I'm talking about. Um, I never liked doing that because the color of the background heavily, what's the word, heavily collided with the color of my Warframe. So I'm kind of glad that they have just a simple background. But that's just me. Are you still selling your trash common items? Um, I think that's... I haven't tried... I haven't put anything in the trash yet, so... I haven't tried, uh, selling anything yet. Alright, just give, just give this guy a quick touch-up so I can, uh... Stop looking like I just got the default skin on.
Uh, so far the game is performing pretty good. It's just still stuttering. It didn't, uh, I should say it didn't, but it seems they fixed the stuttering issue in the demo, but it seems like it came back, so yeah, let's see what that's all about. Also, it's so nice having every color of the rainbow to your disposal right off the bat. I don't have to unlock blue anymore. I get that. I get that gold bronze co color going. I don't think it's RAM stutter. I have 16 gigs of RAM. I'm not sure it shouldn't be taking all of it. Unless I have a memory leak, and that's gonna be that's a different that's a whole different problem on its own. What do you guys think for the main body? Dark or bright colors? I forgot if I answered you already, Kodai, but uh, get, the game's performing good. Just the main problem is just I keep getting these occasional stutters. Like, uh, it'll run good for like 30 seconds and then just have a really bad stutter, but then be fine again in another 30 seconds. Ah, it really depends on what's happening. I'll meet you in the middle and go gray. Dark, dark highlights, bright trim. Yeah, bright trim, dark highlights, gray main.
We need a new we need a new nickname for Fashion Frame. Fashion Javelin just doesn't really roll off the tongue as good. I don't really have a favorite gun just yet. Jav looks, Jav frame, band them, Ash Jav, not bad. Swaglin. <laughs> as much as I hate the word swag, that kind of rolls off the tongue better. So many, and I, I could. Hey, freelancer, contract all right? Owen filled me in on what happened. You've got a problem out there. Some kind of Dominion heavy. His people called in the Monitor. We couldn't stop it. And he was there for a Shaper relic? Tore the place apart. Your agent wouldn't give in. Right to the end, she... Well... I know. I'm sorry. She left this archive behind. I'll have my people dig into it. The Dominion really have returned. In force. Damn. I thought spies took everything in stride. We also respect our enemies. Life under Dominion rule isn't much of a life at all. And if they have set their sights on Fort Tarsus... Right. Well, uh, the fort isn't exactly my idea of living the dream, but it is home. And I'd prefer it to remain dictator-free. What can we do? For now, remain patient. I don't want to make a move until I have more information. In the meantime, there's someone I'd like you to meet. Sentinel Bryn. She's sharp, trustworthy, and could use some assistance. Why don't you help her while I look into the Dominion? I'll be in touch. Sentinel Rissa Bryn. Fort Command. Sentinel. How can we help? Well, uh, we probably shouldn't talk here. Come see me by my desk. And my plants. Plants? Right. So, uh... Good. I will see you. Okay, then. Yeah, it, it really, it's really night and day when uh, the static conversation when it's an actual Freelancer, cutscene. how's it going? It's Matthias Sumner checking in. By the way, I finally cleared out the clutter from my lab so I can resume my work. I'll be there if you need to talk. Oh, okay. Whenever, whenever that part where I said, uh, yeah. Uh, what's, what are you? Ah, my new friend. You listened well to my story of Freemark, huh? Never heard it told like that. I was long retired. The battle was not mine to fight. But good friends tell me. I was a freelancer for many years. You know what freelancers do. We deal with things beyond the wall. Problems. We help people. Truth, but it's not so small as that. We explore, we fight chaos, we save lives. You hear me? Okay, I hear you. People could count on us. In this world, a big deal. But that has been lost. People don't trust us. Hard times now. But enough gloom. Got a contract for you. Going to protect some arcanists doing seismic tests, okay? Seismic tests? Yeah, check to see if Fort Tarsus has strong foundation. Don't want it to fall into a hole like last time. What? But these tests attract animals. The kind with teeth, you know? You protect one side of the fort, and Freelancer Wright will protect the other. You hear me? I hear you. Good. Now go. I'm hungry. No breakfast yet. <laughs> Yeah, Yarrow's definitely a uh, Mr. Exposition. Like I 
Okay, so let's put some stuff in the in the trash and then try to sell it and see if that works. Okay, I don't think you can sell, you can't sell things for coins, you have to, like, do missions. As, uh, yeah, salvage, salvage all over, yeah, there's no, there's no sell for coin option. Early lunch for Kanzu. <laughs> God. Now, when Fortuna first came out, the Plains of Ayalon just fucking died. No surprise. I, I, actually, I think I think Cetus is back to being more populated than Fortuna since people Eidolon hunt. Yeah, Hannah kind of sucks, but I've been getting 2,000 coins per mission, so honestly, what little stuff there is to buy at the moment, it's not really an issue even. I gotta say, if this is the final case, then uh, this game's this game's microtransaction hell is a uh, pretty subtle for a hell. <laughs> My, I think my big, I think the biggest thing I can say is like, if you can survive Warframes microtransaction slash time gating for cosmetics, then this game's gonna be no different than it, no different or better or worse than Warframes case. If you if you can fashion frame in Warframe, you'll be able to swag. You'll be you'll be able to swaggle in, in this game. Are we, are we really using that swaggling? Patching in Freelancer Yarrow. Yarrow here. Let's see if we can keep some Arcanists alive, yes? Freelancer Wright has begun her patrol. This is Wright. By the man says, I'm on my way. Let's see what we can do, Wright. Seismic indicator is ready to go. Okay? Start it up. Hate this part. Always makes me nervous. Remember, these tests attract animals. Don't know why. Make sure the Arcanists stay healthy, you understand? Got it. I'll keep an eye out. Wild animals incoming! Did the, did the audio just cut out for you guys too? Uh... Yep. 
Okay, so they haven't fixed that yet. Great. Okay, so almost three hours in, we've had one freeze and one bug. Uh, take that for what you will, if that's a good or a bad thing. Well, now it's just awkwardly quiet. <laughs> uh, I think the only way to fix this is reload the mission. No, I don't play. I don't play music on YouTube streams. The millisecond that hears one word from Katy Perry, the whole thing is copyrighted. Let's see if this. Let's see if this brings it back. If not, just restart it. Bring us hard. Restart it. Yeah, no, whole game is dead. <laughs> uh, Lake Connor, you uh, got an interesting time. We've been playing for three hours now, so we've had one frash and now just one bug. This one bug apparently killed the audio to the game. So... if we can rejoin before it's too late. Yeah, H1, the thing with that is, like, it'll be copyright now, or co it'll be copyright free now, and then whoever the owner of it is just suddenly decides one day, you know what, I'm gonna start monetizing and marketing my music. And then boom, that was copyright free is now flagging all my all my videos. So, yeah, I, that's why I, I stream mostly on Twitch, but YouTube is where all the people are. Twitch is where Twitch is a better streaming service, but YouTube's where all my audience is, so I really win in that situation. Oh, when I, when I streamed Dishonored in, in YouTube, um, all the streams got copyright got copyrighted because I passed by some music player that was playing apparently a copyrighted piece of background music. So I had to appeal all those streams, and it just got really freaking annoying. Guys, come over here. You guys, pick this up. Oh. Oh, if you can hear me. Uh, I forgot there's voice chat in this game. <laughs>
antagonists were found. The scars brought a cage. A cage! Is that? Yes, it is. What? Who? Big Scar. Junk War. Blake. Known to work with many bad people. I'll see what I can do. I'm really considering switching to hard mode. <laughs> Take that, Jump Maul. Let's see about those Arcanists. Grab the, uh... There you go. Grab the... Her up there. Thank you enough. I wasn't sure what was going to happen before you got here. Arcanists are safe. Only cuts and bruises. Call the Sentinels to pick them up. Already done. Good. Nothing more to do here. Check on Freelancer, right? Got it. Hey guys, if you come over here, there's a lockbox. I don't know if you guys grabbed it. Box here, you have chat. Here, open this box. Right here. Get that box. I'd already grabbed it for you guys, but I unlocked. Not to announce. Yeah, I need to figure out if it's my game that's stuttering or if it's because I have if it's because I'm streaming. Because OBS is a bitch when it comes to sucking up performance of your computer. But I need to confirm which is which. Uh, Connor, so far I can, I can still recommend this game if you really, really want it. But um, I'm still going through. I'm still, still forming my opinion. So can't blow it's, uh, it's a mess, and there's no right, no arcanists. It's uh, only scars. Blast. Right. Where are you? says game was perfect and the stream was dodgy so same problem okay so it must be OBS then just being a bitch also sunlight thank god this game was getting so freaking dark <laughs> the item that dropped Any of you guys? I think I asked, are any of you guys lagging? And in which case, the answer is yes. We're seeing a lot of scar bodies over here, away from the campsite. Another issue. Everybody's a little banged up, but alive. Nothing 
got past Wright. Should be okay. Damn right. Oh, good. Very good, my friend. Sentinels are on their way. Glad you made it. My trigger finger was cramping up. <laughs> Job, guys awesome yeah what's up buddy nice open task manager check the network assumed by the game so actually it's more idea I can have that opened hey fella how you doing man I barely got any mails because I joined late. We're doing all right. In the three hours that we've been playing, we've had one freeze and one sound glitch bug, whatever you want to call it. But other than that, the game's been running very decently. I'm gonna be asking. I'm gonna be answering this question all day. <laughs> uh, so far, so far, so so far, so far. Okay, so far, so good. The game's running moderately well. I had to turn on motion blur to turn off motion blur. However, that worked. Uh, for Tarsus, is kind of janky still. Um, as far as the actual game itself, like the actual way the game's working, so far so good. The sprinting in the fort is really there, but not really. It kind of goes from a slow walk to a light jog. I just don't think you're wacky. Is still trying to shovel a fish. Can be available on EA Access. This game is available on EA Access. Yeah, I have Access Premiere. I'm giving that, I'm giving that a shot to see how I like it or not. And uh, yeah, basically that's why that's why I'm able to play the game early as is right now. Very good work out there with the Arcanists. 
People want to believe freelancers have their backs. After Freemark, belief hard to come by. Glad I could help. How's Freelancer Rife doing? Good. She put up a hell of a fight. Of course. She knows I would be angry to write her story for the wall. But, my young friend, she is alive. This is a good story to tell. People will hear of it. Think that'll help around here? Oh, yes. Now, Rife is recovering at the bar if you want to check on her. I will keep an eye out for contracts. Never fear. Uh, waiting on a few reports just now. As much as I hate giving anything related to EA any kind of win whatsoever, the Origin Access Premiere isn't... It isn't a terrible deal. It really, it really ain't. You get their entire library for 15 bucks a month. And the entire library being like every collector, game of the year, legendary edition, etc, etc. Basically on moment's notice. So, it's good if you play a lot of EA games, I guess. Um, if you're in my case, because all my money went to the move. If you can't put like a big down payment on a game right there and then. Um, it's good to have, it's kind of, it's kind of like renting, a, it's kind of like Redbox. Y'all you you remember Redbox? Um, it's kind of the same way Redbox worked. Alright. I should get some more writing done. Too many distractions recently. Well. Alright, well. Um, I think I'm gonna probably cut this stream today because I'm not I'm not done unpacking yet, we're still moving. Like still a process. I just got my studio esque space back put put back together and we're kind of just uh unbox we're still getting shit from the old place back to this place and it's been a process so i kind of need to get back to that but um first impression so far of the game it's not bad it's a little it has a little bit of janks here and there but other than those little things it's working pretty good it's no it's no vip demo that's for sure you know that's what you're afraid of the game's running, the game isn't crashing like every four minutes, there's no loading screens of death. The, like, I mean, you all were there, the only two bugs we ran into was a sound glitch and a hard freeze. But other than those two things, for the whole duration of the three hour, three and a half hours we've been doing this, the game's running pretty good. So, I'm gonna dive deeper into it later on my own time. Um, we'll see what happens. Yeah, once we get, I'm gonna dive deeper into it later. Um, once I get more downtime to myself, and yeah, hopefully I can get a video out to y'all by uh, no promises, but probably, hopefully before the full release. That way, I can give out like a review for everyone who's still curious about if they want to get the game or not. And yeah, hopefully, uh, fingers crossed. So, if you have any questions or anything, ask them now or forever hold your peace. Later. And, yeah. It's gonna. I find a save. I save. I save. Alright then, this video is going to go up on its own, so it's going to be posted like as its own video on my channel, so there you go. But, um, alright. So, as always, I am the Reaper Hunter, and thank you all so much for coming by. I'll probably stream again on YouTube later. If not today, then probably tomorrow. The day after tomorrow, it's, we'll see. Moving's a bitch, but I'll talk to you all later, and, uh, yeah, later.